Hey guys, this is Blue Set. How's it going? Welcome to a brand new episode of Blue Set's Adventure in Minecraft. Well, I've done a lot of work off camera, and as you can see, I am at level 40. Ridiculous on the levels here. Oh god, and I've done quite a fair share of uh, mining. What are we going to be doing today? Well, first of which, we are going to need to get a bucket of water. And, as so happens, there is a nice little, uh, little pond, I would say, little pond, maybe, uh, I think it's over here, not sure, ah, yes, here it is, yep, and we're going to get some obsidian, one of the things I want to do is get myself a crafting station, or not a crafting station, an enchantment station, so that way I can actually go about and craft or enchant my equipment. As you can see, I dug a little bit because the next step I want to do after that is head over to a, oh, I would say a, mm, a desert to collect some sand. That's the, actually the next step I want to do is collect sand. Sand is the next step because let's face it, I need the sand. Okay, that's the top. I'm not going to dig much more on that. And from there, we can continue our merry old way into making a new segment. What new segment you'll be asking? Well, that's a good question because I've yet to actually find out yet. <laughs> Just kidding. Now, actually, the next segment would be um, a food farm. I already got one setting up, and I need a lot more materials to be able to do stuff. But mainly, I need glass. Glass is the major thing that needs to be done. That should be wide enough. Put you back there, move everything back up, move my bed. Um, okay, it's still good. Okay. Just want to make sure because, you know, stuff like that has happened. Okay, let's put this over here. Alrighty then. So, as you can see, I've done quite a fair share of mining and I need obsidian. Now, I was checking on a uh, bit of a testing out type of thing, and I found out where additional villages that I've yet to discover is actually close by, and where two, and I do mean two, desert temples are at in a desert. Holy, uh, holy schmurly, I got things to uh, hunt for. Now, let's see here. One of these tunnels here actually has a connection to a obsidian, and I'm going to go and use that as my basis to get the uh, necessary materials. I got more than enough diamonds. Um, yes, here we go. Tell you what. There we go. No monsters uh, spawning up on that area. And... ah, There we go. Oh, that's what I wanted to see. Alright, and collect the obsidian. I need to have an enchanting station because look at me, I'm level 40. And I've yet to die. That says a lot. <laughs> I want to make sure that I don't die and lose all these levels. Would you imagine that? Ah, uh, this is going to be a bit boring. Let me go ahead and... Well, actually, I only need is four, but I want to collect all the obsidian here because it can be the good start of collecting the next set of materials for a new project. So, yeah, I'm thinking ahead. I'm always thinking ahead of what other things can I go about and build. And for some of you guys who probably are following along, yes, this particular build is fantastic. It is going to be huge. 
I'm thinking of actually making a um a giant old gold farm. That's right, a giant gold farm. Humongous. But how huge is huge? So that's what I got actually to plan up on that. So, let's go ahead and collect all these materials. I already have more than enough as it is, but who knows? I might actually find diamonds underneath this obsidian. And it's always a good thing to actually collect obsidian as much as possible. Because who knows? Ender chests is going to be a key thing. Also, too, I got to figure out about making a monster farm, a mob farm. Just a general basic mob farm. And I'm trying to think of a many, many, many things to actually correlate with that. Hopefully, it's not too much of a problem. Now, like I said, I'm, we'll be making a food farm and... Ooh, hello. Just now spotted this. Okay. And yes, a food farm. Cows, pigs, sheep. I've already worked on how to actually make rabbits to be cookable. Unfortunately, the system is not entirely perfect. But it is workable. Trust me, it is. It is absolutely workable. But right now, I have only have it for just a small fraction of it. The small fraction I'm talking about is none other than um, getting an unnecessary small amount of, well, you guessed it, cooked rabbit meat. But then again, once I have enough iron, which for some of you people are saying, you have enough iron, Blue said. No, you don't know me. I like to build big. Anyways... I don't have enough iron to make the massive, massive station I want. Anyways, let's see. It is still daytime. I am thinking of having the crafting station probably over here. Yeah. Because I got books. Let's make it... One more. This ain't going to be pretty. This is just a nice little station to build stuff in and whatnot. Um, no, let's go out. One more. Perfect. Mm, okay, hang on. Flubbed up on one thing. Mathematics. Okay, perfect. Alright, so... Get some diamonds. Get some books. And some wood. Because we need... Bookshelves. Remember all that uh, books we got from the previous episode? Oh yeah. And an achievement. Oh, hang on. All we need is what? Three, six, nine, twelve, roughly. So uh, let's go ahead and do that. Of course, that's not enough. I need at least a few more wood to complete this. Okay. And there we go. All right, let's see here. This is where the enchanting table is going to be at. Perfect. Need to mine that out. 
Nice little segments. Alright. Chuck, chuck, chuck. Okay, looks like the lapis is going to be there. Alrighty, it's starting to work. And the final pieces. Alright. Let's go ahead and put torches on the four corners, and there we go. We got our crafting station. Let's go ahead and put in... Oh, I need three lapis. Oh, hey, it's an unbreaking. Cool. Alright, tell you what. I got lapis. Tons of lapis. But I want to enchant a few more items. Let's see here. That says unbreaking three, whatnot. Well, I'll tell you what. I want my... Um, there we go. I'm breaking one, and here's I'm breaking three. Boom! Wow, that costs only. Really? Only three to enchant? And I have 40! Ooh! Ooh! Look at that! Fortune two! That's not bad. That's not bad. Hey, let's go ahead and enchant the. Hmm. Well, I don't care really, but. Hey, yeah. Another fortune two. I'm thinking of actually going to be uh, another fortune two. Hmm. Tell you what, let's also make a anvil, so that way we can actually combine some uh, equipment. Anvil. Make a fortune three. Why not? Actually, let's go ahead and enchant this because... Or not enchant this. Repair this pickaxe because we need to repair it. Four. Alright. And let's go ahead and... Oops, that's diamonds, not lapis. Hmm. An efficiency three, maybe? Hmm, it is. Well... I can make an efficiency four pickaxe. It won't be a bad idea. And look at that. Efficiency four. Did cost a little bit. Another. Well, might as well keep these two in case I get another pickaxe. Well, tell you what. I am going to have fun with some crafting ideas. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Books, 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 books. Ooh, yes, books. I keep forgetting. Books. Oh, I need 23 levels for that? Ooh. Knock back, knock back, huh. Aha! I knew there was a catch, but hey, why not? Knock back one. Okay, that's not bad. Okay. Let's just go ahead and do that. Deficiency 2. Hmm. Well, I can enchant a book. But let's see here. Uh-huh. 13 for Smite 2. That's not bad. Okay. Not bad. And right now, oh hey, Protection 1. That's going to be good. But I think I'm going to save up on that. And let's just go ahead and combine these two. May not actually get enough for it. And it'll cost three levels that I don't have. Okay. No, actually, this is a fantastic run for that. Uh, let's see here. Let's also make a flint steel. Because I want to build a nether portal. Um, where exactly? It's nighttime right now. Let's go ahead and just build it over here. You know, something simple. Or bury it. Boop, 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 boop. I like three by threes. Don't ask why, I just do. Alrighty. Build a portal. Well, I just tell you that I don't have enough obsidian. 
Hmm. Oh, well, I guess a 2x2 two two is going to be enough then. Just bring that back with me. There we go. Woohoo! Hmm. Eh, whatever. Doesn't produce enough light, does it? Um, oh no, it actually does. Hmm. Well, let's go ahead and just hop on through. Well, let me raise the roof up here real quick. Yeah, I was saying that about going to the nether, huh? Not really much, is there? Well, let's go ahead and head in there, take a look around, and then we'll wait for daylight after that to... Oh, yes, we need to go deeper, achievement! Yay! Alrighty. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Oh. Everything's being loaded, I don't have to worry about Hmm. Nice little cavern. Hmm. I would say so. Ooh, quartz. Lots of quartz. Looks like I'm in a cavern area. Oh, wow. This ain't gonna be good. There we go. Hmm. It seems like I am in a bit of a cavern area. That torch will do. Alright, tell you what, since I have a fortune, let's go ahead and collect some cords. Crap. Hmm. Oh. Okay. Well. Bit scary. What, what, why are we? Oh, we're right in the middle, okay. And look at that, I already got enough experience for what I need else. But no, this is fantastic, though I don't see any glowstone, but quite frankly... Hmm. Almost kind of reminding me of uh, being on a server... I guess some areas are still being loaded up as I'm trying to go through here. In fact, looking at the frame rates, yeah, I don't doubt it. There's a huge amount of chunks being loaded. Try not to get killed here. I'm just curious, what else is around? Okay, that's a drop shoot. Don't need to go there. Lots of caverns all around me. This is not bad, but I don't I'm not at the surface. I'm like some sort of like nether mountain. Yeah. I'm grateful that there's no actual monsters. Is this really on peaceful? Ah oh, I thought I set you too hard. I wonder why I wasn't uh experiencing any monsters. <laughs> yeah. Maybe I should lock it down. Now I'm going to have pigmen showing up, which is fine. You know, pigmen aren't scary. They're not hostile, which I'm grateful. God, would you imagine zombie pigmen being hostile? Crikey. You're going to have a lot of trouble immediately upon that. Well, it is now getting daylight. Let's go ahead and head out to the great yonder. That is Minecraft. As I go about and combining the lapis blocks back together again. Oops. And doing that. There we go. Boom. Boom, 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 boom. Yes. Oh. Whatever. Anyways, put the books back in here. Materials. Just anywhere in general okay we got the water we got everything um i think 
I don't have string. That's right. I don't have string, so I can't make a bow. Hmm. Okay. Well, we are to head towards a desert. I got food on me. Uh, quite a bit of food, actually. Some cooked meats. I think I'm going to be good to go. All right. So, last I was checking, the desert I have already pinpointed was... over in that distance, wasn't it? 500 with a negative. Okay. Okay. So it's that way. Okay. Let's go ahead and head this way. It's in the positive 500s and negative 800. So I am actually heading this way. No problem. That is actually the closest desert. I have actually checked it out. Admis still does work for 1.8. What it is is that when you do go to Admis... Oh, wait. What if I encounter some uh, temples? That's right, that's right. I need a axe. I need an axe. Well then, silly me. Let's go ahead and collect ourselves an axe. Ah, finally, food's going down. I thought I swore I had put it on, um, on hard before recording. That is so embarrassing. <laughs> there you are. Yes, I haven't given myself any proper gear. I still have iron gear. But it's better than nothing. Alrighty. Now that I have an enchanting station, I don't have to worry about anything else. Alrighty. I'll be right back when I encounter something interesting or at the desert. I seriously need to make a mob farm to get ender pearls. Well, here's that village I was talking about. Made it to it. Just barely made it. Oh lord, had to run for the extra stretch here. Trust me, books are always useful, so I'll take them. <laughs> Anyways, plenty of food to be had here, but I'm mainly interested in the desert that is over here. That's right, that's the desert I was talking about. And trust me, after I'm done here, taking the books and all, I will not be coming back here again anytime soon. Except for maybe, perhaps, putting down a a um, actually, is there a cleric? Hmm. Quite a few torches. I think they were like that. I find that weird. No. Oh. Anyways, probably putting on a... N Ooh, wait a minute. Is that a temple? Yes, a desert temple. I knew that there was two desert temples here based on the information that I saw on Adamist, which turns out all you got to do is plug in the uh, seed information, the seed number, into a 1.7.10 uh, build set or profile, and there you go. So it does work. It does work indeed. It's not going to recognize the monuments. Hmm, looks like it's been buried. Yeah, it's starting to load chunks. It's starting to be a bit laggy on my computer. God, man, this is actually pretty interesting that all of a sudden it's now laggy. Looks like a tunnel. I heard they were supposed to be replacing these, uh... Okay. Err. Come on now. Okay. I don't hear nasties. Okay, looks like this got... chunked. Ah. Okay. I 
I know there is a thing with these areas that if you were to you know take the item here and go down that way you're gonna run into Ooh. oh come on okay I thought I heard the pressure plate go that would have been bad Just want to make sure I don't step on the wrong one. Okay, good. <laughs> Remove that out of the way because there's... Ooh! Ooh! Oh, look at that! Awesome! Diamond horse armor. Nice. Some emeralds, more gold. Ooh, looting three! Nice. And okay. No, that's actually pretty good. I'm taking all this. Next thing I need to do is tame. Oh my god, you're kidding me! Haha! <laughs> I found iron here as well. Well then. Probably the one thing I want to do is. Collect the TNT. Oh! Inventory is full. Oh wait, no wonder. Roses and flowers on me. Okay, no wonder. Alright, no, this is fantastic. Alright. Well, that's one temple down. You know what? If I got obsidian, I probably could make a temple a portal here. Clear out the sand. Hmm. First of which, just chuck the peonies out of the way and make ourselves a nice station. Yeah. Nice station. Put all the stuff I have found and excavated up away. And why don't we start? Digging. All right, ah, that's not bad. I want to actually level this out a bit. Yeah, let's go ahead and clear out this temple. I know there is a second one nearby. So I want to go and find that because it too is buried. Would you imagine that? And besides, cleaning up a dungeon, or a temple in this case, shouldn't be too hard of a work. In fact, I want to actually replace most of this... Uh, Material. Hmm. Looks like a cave network down here. I don't know, but judging from all the stonework here, I'm thinking probably a bit of a cave network. Ooh, yeah, here's some nasties. Ooh. Yeah. Just prove to you guys that I never actually fought a monster while uh, mining. Goes without saying. Alright. Well, we made it to the, the desert. Found ourselves a nice. I'm gonna say, um. Uh, hmm. 
a bit of mushrooms. Yeah. Some mushrooms, okay. Alright, tell you what, um, I need to put a bed down somewhere. I'm going to explore everything. But I need sand, and sand is what I need. And I found it here, in plenty of abundance. Hmm. I know, it does look a bit weird that it's still buried, but hey, all in due time, people. I want to go about and torch up as much as possible. I mean, it's still pretty much buried. I'm not going to be in a fuss or a rush to go about and unfree it. Yeah, something like that. Prevent the nasties from coming in. I may do a fence something. Nice gates or something. Alright, tell you what, let me get a bed. Put it right here. In fact check around to see where I have missed certain things. Actually, this area will be perfect for a beacon location. Yeah, actually, a beacon will be perfect here. Now that I think of it, a good subject for a beacon will be here. Might think about getting some stonework. Actually, this wouldn't be a bad idea to make a uh, mining outpost. Yeah, mining outpost too. This won't be a bad idea. Ah, it's getting nighttime. Okay, my thoughts of going to the other dungeon is a bit running short. But no, this is fantastic. The only way they can get in is through this way. Ooh, got an idea. Got an idea. Oops. Oh, this is orange stained clay, uh, clay. So this is stained clay that's actually here. Now that makes sense. Okay. This would be a death trap for any monsters jumping down here anyways. So no, that's good. I thought it was stained glass, not stained clay. Okay, makes sense now. Alright, let's go ahead and sleep. There we go. And, let's head over to the other temple. Is that it over there? Um, kind of hard to tell. Ah, chunks are loading as I'm walking and recording. Oh! Ha! There it is! Had to turn around. Okay. Hmm. I guess they all look in the same direction, huh? Ah, lag. Okay. Chunk lag. Well then. Wow! I didn't know it was that buried. That's interesting. Looks like the only way in is... Well, I'm through this way. Yeah. Ah, come on, computer. Work with me. Okay, so this is all stained clay. Now oh, I'd like to come through here and put beacons in this area. And remove the uh, stained clay with uh, stained glass. And of course, they're all identical, but I want to see about. Seriously, computer? Seriously? Okay. Ah! Uh. Seriously, geez. Yeah, just make 
making sure there's no monsters down there. There is. Oh, Lord. We all know. Okay. Well, we're down here. Ah, come on. There we go. No. Dang it. I think it's just my computer having troubles, I think. Honestly, pick the wrong time to go and do that computer. Well, considering that it will be down here, I would think... Yeah, here we go. Yeah, sorry about the random stutters. For some reason, my computer is having a hard time with some issues with Minecraft. I don't know why. All right, well, that area is taken care of. Let's put some sandstone back up. And it looks like it's just smooth stone uh, down here. Okay. Okay, let's take a look and see what we have. Ooh, ooh, some nice diamonds. Seriously, what is trying to update? There isn't. It's just my computer's being a derp. Oh, I didn't check that one. Um, okay, diamond. No, looks like it was gold. Probably a few diamonds and run flash. How nice. Hmm, bones. Okay, that's cool. And oh look another diamond horse armor. Actually this is quite a haul. Well then I might as well come back down here next time. And I'm go definitely going to remove the center here to make it as Okay, that was stupid. <laughs> yeah. That was stupid. Um, I'm surprised armor didn't take damage from that fall. Okay, well, at least now I can actually probably put a a single beacon here, probably a mining or speed or whatnot. So yeah. That sounds pretty good. Alright, let me go ahead and get on out of here. I want to collect everything I can. Oh, wow. Seriously, computer, what the heck is wrong with you? Just now, of all things, you've handled uh, larger data. And of course, because of the lagginess. Well, I'll tell you what, guys. Since I'm here at the desert, I don't think I'll be able to get much done. Let me go ahead and cut this real quick and work on getting the um, sand that I need. And I will be right back. Well, a better part of the day has gone through of extracting the temple out of the desert. Eh, come on. There you go. Yep, the temple out of the desert. Didn't really take too long. And in fact, there's actually plenty more for me to actually go and make it look nice. But I'm afraid we are running over time. And yes, we are running over. Just as the sun is setting, so too is this episode. Unfortunately, I didn't accomplish all that I stated I wanted to do. But hey, thank you for watching this episode, episode 3 of Blue Set's Adventures in Minecraft. Episode 4 will commence 
uh, as soon as possible, hopefully. And we will get the a particular farm going with all this sand, not sandstone, but sand, to be taken care of. Of course, I will run over to my base to smelt said sand, and I should bring over all these enchanted gear. Hmm. Well, we'll see. As always, thank you for watching, and have a good day.